Hey my little angels and welcome back to another video you guys. So anyhow, as this event has just come out yesterday, I did it and recorded it so we can go on and look at how to do it today. So basically there are some more new items over here. So you have this globe, you have the box, you have this cute artifacts. As you know, these are all sham items technically, <laughs> but I decided to get some more stuff. So those are from last time, but do get this stuff now because they are collectors, so you won't be able to get it anymore after this, and you can't trade anyone else for these, at least at this point in time. So I'm just going to add all these different items in, and we shall see how like they look like over here. Oh, this is just, this will be coming up in the future, this bucket thing, I'll let you know in a bit. But anyhow, so I'm just going to place all these, so cute, <laughs> such cute little plushies and everything. Anyways, just a bunch of random stuff. The box, though, is something you'll actually be able to climb on. So just see where you'd like to put that. Damn, I did I just like glitch it? <laughs> because I put it and I ended up right outside of the igloo. Anyways, this was last year's den, just letting you know. And let's get right on into the video now. So I shall just tell this to you in steps. You can do the event in any steps, just at the end you need 7 clothing items, of which 2 are found from the gifts, with a 3.85% chance of getting them from the gifts, and the rest is by doing other tasks I will talk about soon, and you need 7 snowmen in, the in your bag as well. You get a snowman badge and a snow globe house at the end of it, but you do need quite a bit of money for that, and you need to work fast, <laughs> because not a lot of time to do this event. So anyways, step one, you can go and get two buckets of water, which is $80 each from the seed shop when it opens, then go water some crops in the barn or in your home, and use those two water buckets, and then you will find empty buckets in your bag after you do that. So you'll get two empty buckets after doing that. Then you will go to the middle of the ice for step three, and click on an empty bucket, and click to use and run around a little bit in that area without pressing the green check mark to collect the snow in the bucket, as you can see me do. So you repeat this process again with your second bucket as well. Now you will have two buckets of snow in your bag, so click the sign and it will give you the option to exchange two buckets of snow for a cute little snowman and return you these two buckets empty. So it'll be back in your bag again and they'll be empty now, so you gotta fill it up with snow again then you'll have to get more snowmen. So repeat those past steps I just told you and collect seven snowmen in your bag. They're so cute. <laughs> now we will go get the seven different clothing items called props to complete this event. While waiting for the gifts, we can start doing the other steps. So it is easier doing it with another friend or two, especially in the robbing and arresting tasks. You can do these in any order and the percentages are random. So it's up to chance when you will get the item from any given job. Job, task, one of the same thing. So here I'm just going to say start by fishing. You can get the sticks which are used as arms from fishing. So that's one of the props. While you're fishing, do save the cheese you fish out and keep it in your bag. Go to the pizzeria and click on Murray who says that she loves cheese. She will give you an orange scarf. That's your second prop. Now become a robber and steal from any person. You will get a green cap at the end of a rob if you complete it without getting caught. That's your third prop. For the silver bucket hat, let a cop catch you. Once your time in prison is up, this clothing item will pop up. Basically, it'll be put into your bag. So that's your fourth item. Next, do become a cop and arrest some robbers. As soon as you arrest, you will get the black top hat which is your fifth item, fifth prop. The last two items you need will be in presents, as I mentioned before, so keep opening the gifts, and from them you will be able to get a blue ribbon and red gloves or mittens, whatever you want to call them. And yeah, those are your sixth and seventh props. Remember, it may take some time to obtain the items because there's a random chance. Like, it, for the first time it took me 12 fishing tries to get the sticks, for robbing, it took me quite a few robs, like 10, 12 robs. But for arresting someone, it took me on my first try and second try again, I got it. So it's very random, but gifts took quite a bit of time. 
So the props are tradable as well, so you can trade your friends and exchange props. Just note that the two props from the gifts are more valuable than the others. Finally, you are ready to go get yourself the prize. Once you have all seven props in your bag and the snowman, go to the middle of the ice where the sign is, click on it, and you'll be able to get your orb. And now when you go over to put your house, you have the option of buying a snow globe house. It is so big. This costs $200,000 though. So you'd have like 10 days to do this. If you have enough money, great. If you don't, I can help you get some money if you have any like trade offers. But anyways, yeah, so this event will be leaving at the same time as the Christmas gifts one in my city. So basically 10 days from today, so better hurry up. <laughs> And yeah, congrats, you have finished this event as well now, and enjoy the beautiful big igloo and decorate it however you wish with the new limited time collectibles also, since you have more space to store house items too now. And also there are no passwords on the private rooms allowed right now, and the any sort of like private, like different named rooms you make actually ask for like 20 players right now. That's just to prevent farming from happening too much, like too much gift farming and all that. That will be, go. that will go back to normal after this event ends probably. So that's pretty much it. I hope you guys have an amazing day. I think this was pretty explanatory. If you have any other questions, feel free to drop it below or like you can DM me in Discord as well. That's about it. Bye you guys. Cute and slow. As always, peace.